Hey guys, Jessica here from Family Adventures TV. And as you can see, Joe is fixing one of our decks. Actually, he's replacing it. And if you see what Family Adventures TV! And if you see what we used, check out the link in the description and uh, you can see some other reviews and stuff like that in there. So check it out. But we're gonna show you really quick replacement. I mean, it takes like just a few minutes. It's like, what, three volts, honey? Four. Four volts. Um, if you can get them all back if in. If you can get them all back in. Like, if people drill the holes properly. <laughs> so, this is how to replace your scissor jacks on your RV. Make sure you get ones that are higher quality than have been already put on with the factory because we've already bent two of those, which is why we're getting putting three more on after already replacing and making one higher quality. Yeah, so if you want to see a smash jack, you can't tell too much, but you can tell a little bit that it's bent. So we've got to put a new one, a sturdier one, a steadier one. Okay, what is this? What are you doing right now? I got to take the bolts off of underneath here, just bolt it up there, here, there. And okay, it's so 10 how? millimeter. A 10 millimeter what? Socket or so, wrench or whatever. A what? Need, I guess. Well, what is this? I'm using a socket wrench. Okay, you got a socket wrench. Okay, yeah. so is it safe to do Probably not when it's so tense. I might loosen it up. <laughs> <laughs> <don't think> right. <gasps> okay, just checking. I mainly want to change this one first, but this is a broken one. Or I just break it more. Uh, okay, okay, so like, okay, okay. It's not gonna fall. <laughs> Are you sure? Yep. I remember I changed one already before. I don't know. I don't remember. I think I was worried then too. Probably, but you were inside. Uh, and we also were not on a hill. We were on a hill. No. We went to Tennessee. Tennessee was <sighs> We were on a hill, but we weren't leaning sideways like this craziness. Alright. There it goes. Okay, so it's bolted in up to the top. Cool. All right, yeah, we'll let you know whenever it gets. I guess I'm... Okay, so what did you remember? We need a bigger size for this bolt. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna be a 14. Dad, that's it. 14 for this nut. Oh, no, okay, yeah. so this is the difference between the factory one that Forest River Wolf Pup has on it and the one that we're putting on it. So the 24 inch scissor jack. City boy. <laughs> okay, so the new jack is on. Ta da! Uh, now we're just gonna. Ta da! <laughs> so now we just gonna put our leveling. Oh! Ah, now you, you, did you didn't it. see that. Yeah, yeah, we did. And I'm gonna. Maybe if I use the right size. That would probably. But I don't know, cause you're the you're the evil mastermind. Oh. Behind this stuff. There's one. <sighs> and so that means we've got two good jacks on this thing and now we're going to put another. So we've had this jack on but on the other one for what six months, seven months maybe? Probably close. So I don't even see the brand on here. Ult is it Ultra Fab the brand? I guess. Well this thing this is what we were using and um we're going to put a link in the description to this jack or something similar to it. And you can read the reviews and stuff. You can click on the link to see those reviews. So, check that out. And we are going to go get the other ones off. So, thanks for hanging out with us today, guys. While my hubster gets these scissor jacks on the RV, make sure to like, subscribe, and comment for any other videos that you want to see. We do lots of product reviews coming up at you as well as adventure videos and uh, some other fun things with family so check it out thanks for hanging out today